If you have a child starting school next year, it can be a confusing, busy and overwhelming time. But I'm here to provide a few tips and tricks on how you can best provide that support for your child, but also so you can feel a sense of calm. So letter A, set them up for success. A successful school day starts as soon as the child wakes up from home. So try to create a familiar morning routine. Prepare uniforms and pack lunch bags the night before to avoid the chaos in the morning. Allow your little one to have a sense of autonomy. Put them all in one basket and let them go and put their own uniform on, but see that there's a shirt and pants and socks and things in there. Allow your little one to feel a sense of calm and create a positive mindset for ready for the day. To do this, provide lots of verbal positive talk about the day ahead. Your friends are gonna be so excited to see you or remember you get to do your artwork today. Try to avoid leaving things to the last minute when having to result to things like, quick, pack your bag, quick, put your uniform on, quick, get ready, we've got to go. Use a visual schedule or a visual countdown um, timers to help them see, actually see how much time they've got left to do an activity. Have a basket for each child containing all of their uniform bits, as I said, to put on rather than choosing it for them and making them find all of the bits and pieces to put on. Let it be, be on time. Make sure your child arrives at school on time. When they're late, children can feel embarrassed or like they may have missed out. This can cause a flow on effect to the rest of the day and affect their mood throughout the rest of the day. And make sure that you pick them up on time too, especially in the first few weeks of kindergarten. That way your child won't be sitting there all day thinking, really excited to see mum and dad, but I hope I'm not the last one picked up again today. Let us see. Remind them of the school pickup plan. Reminding them fresh each morning is important. It might be helpful to have a little laminated card that you can hook onto their bag that's either a picture of a car, a after school care building, or a bus, um, or the walking line, and um, refresh them which way avenue, however, they're getting home that day. Um, number D, or letter D, sorry, give prior warning of planned change. Social stories can be created at school or by yourself at home. They're quite simple to set up, or you could do this in collaboration with one of your occupational therapists or even a speech path. They can um, explain a, cha a planned change coming up, such as a change in teacher, an excursion coming up, or a change in classroom setting for that day, for example. So there are some tips and tricks on how you can build a sense of security for your child. Part two, I'm going to speak about how we can help make, manage social adjustments and social change.